When you're doing the hope and luck follow-up system, the reason that most sales trainers tell you, just don't quit, 80% of sales are made after the seventh follow-up or 12th follow-up or 27th follow-up or whatever stat they're making up at the time. The reason they say those things is because they're kind of true. If you're just operating off of hope and luck, all you can hope is that if you do enough crap, they'll eventually say, popcorn guy, candy guy, business card guy, guy that keeps sending me emails. Okay, what, what do you want? Well, I do this stuff and here's all my features, advantages and benefits. I'm not interested in that. We've looked at it before. We're not gonna, we're not gonna do anything like that. I understand how you feel. Others felt the same way, but what they found after meeting with me. Okay, old school crap, law of familiarity. It's the Facebook test. Think about this. If you're anything like me, you get a lot of Facebook friend requests all the time. I don't tend to accept those friend requests if I'm not familiar with that person. If I don't know them, if we have nothing in common, if there's not a reason for us to be friends on Facebook, they don't pass the law of familiarity test. Therefore, I do not do their call to action of becoming friends. They're only operating off of hope and luck. If we meet through an event, through a chamber, through a friend, through a referral, through this, and we become familiar with each other, I am more likely to do whatever it is you're asking me to do, the more familiar I am with you. And the magic, like listen, 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 please, the magic of what I teach inside of the DM handshake, we'll link that video somewhere down there below for you, how to schedule more appointments than ever, how to schedule more appointments easier, I call it the DM handshake in my training, is because they are already familiar with, <laughs> they're familiar with what? They're familiar with what you do. They're familiar with your features, advantages, and benefits. They're familiar with the product that you sell and the price that you sell it at. They're, oh no, oh, you've been following me a little while. You know that all of that is stupid. Good job, you're right. They're familiar with who you serve. They don't give one flip about what you do unless they are the avatar that you serve. Go watch the avatar training video. I say that all the time because if you haven't watched it, you don't understand how critical it is to your entire business. It's literally the foundational thing. Audio jungle.